So the film starts out and Harrison Ford and his mate are going in the temple and he's like, mate, this is going to be spooky temple. And mate's like, yeah. And so they go in and there's a hole and Harrison's like, nice try, bitch, I can fly and soups over it. And then there's like pressure plates and then there's like pressure plates. And he's like, mate, arrows and forget his mate and he's not important and he can't and he just he can go he goes and dies in a second anyway so Han Solo is like goggle pressure plates and he gets a bag of cocaine and he swats it out for a sign photo of Brian Cranston and he's like oop oop hold on oop oop and then he snorts the coke and grabs Walton's nugget away and he and he runs and he runs out quick like and he's go he's, and he goes go, and he got go ooh and he goes, nice try, Hitler. And then there's like... He... And the next thing you know, he's looking at the Ark of the Covenant from Halo 2. And he's like, bitch, I read the strategy guide. And he closes his eyes. Also, there were Nazis too. Indie games really changed how we see gaming industry. And uh, how the whole, some major successes among certain developers. My favourite of which is Oguado McMilligan's. Edward has made a strong meaty man. The Binding of Isaac, more like Binding of Shit because it's so shit, and Call of Duty Ghosts. I know a lot about indie games because my cousin saw PewDiePie in a charity shop once, and he got his autographs, and he only plays indie games. Also was Armando's friend, who looks like Twiglet. He made art or music or some other pointless shit. He's not even a real Bantler lad. <laughs> Then there's this Fez guy, who seems like a right chat, who doesn't even wear a Fez. I mean, represent your fans, mate. You're only cool because you have the part where you jump in the pool, and your eyes are open with your glasses, and you're like, Ooh, look at me, I'm so much better than Rory. He can't open his eyes in the water. I'm so cool. What a dick. But then there's, like, people as well, but well, those other people, they, who gives a shit? I mean, they didn't even make Minecraft. Then Chewbacca climbs in the fridge and the nuke goes off and he's like hoi, 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 and flies through the air and crashes in the ground breaking every bone in his body and he's like why does it always have to be snakes? <laughs> Am I right? Oh and Bray guys seem pretty swell. 